Um, we're going to start with the system. Uh, this is a really rare find to see at a pawn shop. At least in Pawn America. Pawn America. For this, for this price, and maybe if you're looking bad, what what year were they in? The 1980s, 70s? Um, Genesis. Yeah. The 89. 89. So this is at least, at least in the U.S. I think, I, think, so, I think it came out 88 in Japan. So for 1989, say to Genesis, this is a Model One. For it, first, this isn't the first released Model One because the first released Model One says high definition graphics on here, but this is still like this is probably released like 1991. This. Okay, but it's still a Model 1, though. Yeah, it's still a Model 1. It's, so it's a Model the first, 1. The first ones say high-definition graphics up here. Up in the top. So this was a Sega Genesis. It came with a very used controller, like very, very used. You can still play it, but it's very loose. Um, uh, it came with a console. It came with controller and uh, RF. Yeah, shitty one. I, uh, I, I, don't know if it, I don't know if there's necessarily anything where I could be, but it was kind of However, shitty. we did... I'm gonna skip that for now. We don't don't tie it to it. So yeah. for for a set of Genesis, they're not too expensive. I mean, uh, I mean, there's, model twos are normally a little bit cheaper because there's more of them. So for a model one, this was for for everything: the console, the controller, the RF cable. It didn't um, come with the AC adapter. Yeah, it did not come with the AC adapter. So for that, Pawn America was selling it for. Fourteen ninety nine. That ain't bad. It works. And it works. We played it last night, so we know it works. Um, we always Over, sort of overall, it's not like some of the chrome yeah. paint on the sixteen bit came off. But hell, if you ever want to sell this and rebuy it, me granted, maybe lose five bucks having to rebuy. It, you could get a one that looks like even better than this. So uh, I, mean, I mean, it's a it's, decent... it's, it's it's good looking, but the only thing that kind of sucks is some of the chrome paint came off the sixteen bit. That's, that's, yeah, that's, that, that's really the only thing. Other than that, it's not bad. And for yeah. a Sega Genesis, I mean, what can you go wrong for four, 15 bucks? Yeah. And uh, we actually left. We actually bought these games and then left. And then we were at, an, at that Goodwill or something. And we were talking about it. It's like, God damn it, you got to buy it because, you know, it's a great deal. And we, after we were done there, we came back. Bought it, luckily it was still there, so, I mean, not bad. Yeah. I mean, we'll see. I also bought, speaking about the RF cable, that was, like I said, it was a shit one, so. Um, Addison knew about this British company. It it's British, a British website. British website that sells uh, the component cable. Not with component. Composite. There, there's this one um, company who did a Kickstarter like two years ago, and they, they were actually able to somehow make a component cable for the Genesis, but they sell it for like 50 bucks and you're cheap, so you probably wouldn't buy it. It's better than composite, but I don't know, you're pretty cheap, so. But the cable that I bought. Yeah, 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 it's, that was like 12. But if, if, you, if you were to ever want to buy a component cable, it cost you like 50 bucks. Yeah, I'm not gonna spend 50 bucks for a goddamn cable. This I, one, this, I would. This cable? It, me personally, I, I'm, I'm actually looking into buy it. They're out of stock right now, but when they come into stock, I'm probably gonna order it as, as soon as possible. So this I had, the one that I bought, it had stereo in it, so. Yeah. And you look online, you can't find them. They only have the yellow and the white uh, AV cable, and I needed, I wanted the stereo. Which is the red? So I got that for fifteen bucks. I was from from somewhere in the UK. And hey, maybe you can bring back your package time series and open it. <sighs> package time. Well, wait, what, what was it? No. I, I don't remember what your what you opened for your like like the three or four you did. I forgot. What they, I think well one of them was a bowling ball actually. Yeah, well, I, don't I don't remember what the other ball. ones were. Like, um, I don't know. Jesus, I haven't made one of those. Those don't barely have any, any, any views at all. But yeah, yeah they are kind of older though. Yeah, they're a little bit old. So say the Genesis, yes, good deal. You know, fifteen bots came with kind of everything. Yeah, and the RF the RF cable thing wasn't official though, but it said it could work for NES and SNES. So. so yeah, this is the controller, and it just feels like really, really cheap. Like this thing. Apparently is official, yeah, but it's it's just not it's right. It's really used. And I'm surprised it even still works. So 
the controller. Um, however, like I said, it did not come with the power brick, so we went to visit another thrift store in the area called Hops. We got an official. Yeah, I, I remember we we were there a few weeks ago. And they and, had it. And they had it. I was like, they might still have it. And even if not, Pond America may may have had one laying around somewhere. You know, so but but yeah, but yeah, Hops had it, two fifty. Two dollars and fifty cents. I mean I, I mean official ones on eBay were actually ten. So, yeah, so this yeah, was a yeah. really good deal. So in total, I mean this thing costs like eighteen bucks maybe at most. However, since I since this controller is very easy we went to we got game. Oh, they forgot to put your game in. <laughs> oh, great. Well, you still have your receipt, right? Yeah. Well, man, we should go back there. Right. Not, right we don't, I mean, we don't have to show. I mean, I think people know what Sonic 2's cart looks like. But. Sonic 2 cart. Yeah, so we got that. However, they didn't put the fucking cartridge in it. has the manual, though. It probably doesn't have the poster. Most games, people don't check right. the posters. Yeah, I know back there. Um, and then, and when we were there, we also got a very nice and, looking and this is the Genesis. This is the, um, this this controller was released when they when um they they released the model three Genesis. This is the controller the three button one I have or this is the one I prefer. I know a lot of people prefer this design of of six button when they work properly at least. But I, I like this one. I mean I know I know the D pad is more prone to break. But I mean if you keep if you keep the shit good, if you if you if you take good care of your shit, it's it's gonna be good. Plus it has like you can use turbo on it, which is nice. And the mode button's a lot better because it's actually like it's like the start button instead of this. I mean, I mean, you don't press the mode button too often, but still. I don't know. I, I I just prefer this one. All right, so we just came back from the we got game. We got my cartridge bat in a pretty nice spot. Here we go, and then we got the actual. Yeah, be, be careful when you open those. Ah, uh, because they'll scratch or whatever. Yeah, be careful. So, got the disc. Disc, yeah. Disc, yeah, it's a disc. It's the cartridge. Man. Cartridge, disc. Yeah, let, me see, let me see the pins on it. Oh, the pins on it. Not bad, that looked pretty good. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah be careful when you do that. Well, we got that back. After the lens in it, it, it kind of felt a little white, and I was like, oh fuck, I opened that up, but, ah! Oh and shit! Then, so you got, you got a new game. You were going to buy it originally, but Pawn America had this game for thirteen dollars. I would say it's it's not expensive, but I mean it's definitely not thirteen. And and we got games price. You know it was, it was five. Made by THQ. Holy shit! It's a long time ago. Yeah. So this one that we got game was four ninety nine, so five bucks, which yeah. is. A lot better, and, and just out in the display, they could have had more, but they had, they had like three. So, so that's yeah, why that, that's, that, that could deal with a little bit why it's a <sighs> We got this back, yay, I feel happy now. I can play my games with the Sega Genesis and whatnot. Let's go. Yeah, you have like one of the best games in the system. Yeah, if I can. There we go. Let's go play Sega. There we go. Let's go play it. Hey, am I winning yet? No, I'm not. Fuck this. Yeah, I have to say... This controller sucks. I don't think this is the real deal. Compared to this... That's a different model, though. Oh. Of the controller. Oh, this fucker's got turbo on it. Yeah. Holy I, shit. I was saying that, dude. I was like, this controller even has turbo. Dude, nice. Alright. It even has slow option. If you want if you want to beat like things that are really tough. Cool. Well, then I got a good control. Alright. That's the end of my pick video to move careful. on to if you're, you're too, if you're too rough with the keypad, you can break this, okay. this controller, like, if you're not careful. I'll probably put it away every time I'm done playing it. So. I need to clean this. It's a little sticky. Oh. Keypad is a little sticky, but overall it's decent. Alright, cool. Well, this pick video. We'll see you in a bit.